because the school had like Friday prayers on every Friday in the school hall. So they have Friday prayers and and, and that, was, that was like when ISIS was popping off. I, <laughs> ISIS now fell off. They fell off, bro. You know what? They don't need the distraction from ISIS. It's yeah. COVID now. Yeah, yeah. They they so. fell off, bro. They fell off. It was, it was popping. I'm waiting for the comeback. When we were in school, I'm waiting for the comeback. When we were in school, yeah. there was Coney. You remember Coney? <laughs> yeah. The black one, why, you know the black guy? Why are kids in Bankstown scared Coney's gonna come get them? Oh, bro. From Africa. I never wanted to get tattoos. I always got scared. They get Are you gonna keep going? Yeah, it's done. It's done now. Now this is all here. It's gonna start. I like the sticker stuff, though. Yeah, so do I. I started off, oh, like, I wanna give this meaning, this meaning. What? Brother, I'll get a fucking, <laughs> I'll get a fucking potato now. I don't care. <laughs> I'll get an apple cool. here. It suits you, bro. But you know who I've been like, who me and my mates always like, we, that, that, that guy, um, the one that you put up is like a dark guy and he plays basketball. Baby Joel. Yeah, you know him? Yeah. Right, me and my mates always, fuck, we like, oh, let's go to Sydney. Let's go to the park takeover. We'll run a on everyone. We want to go. Yeah. Because that's what they play at. They play at, um, what do they do? Is that Sydney? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's and Sydney and they, they, they get people from overseas, like local players and stuff. And they... They just bring them down. They have a park takeover. Like Nick Curious went to one and this I and saw. that. They just did one, yeah? They just did one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, can anyone play? Or is it like That's the thing. My mates, my mates all message me like, let's go. You wouldn't go. I'm like, oh, well, fuck, I'll go. I don't care. Um, by the way, can we swear on it? Yeah, say whatever I, you want. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> whatever you want. <laughs> Bro, I'm like, I'll fucking go. I don't care. I'll clean anyone in basketball. I'm the cockiest person in basketball. Like, you know, when? Rag- rugby league, I was like humble, this and that. Basketball, not nah, different. When all did like, you start playing? Bro, always. I've always been playing. But then I uh, didn't realize... Like I was good enough to play in the NBA until like last year. <laughs> last year, oh I'm like, oh my nah. god! Okay, last year, I'm, I'm like, I swear to God, last year was like different. I swear to God, Nabil, if you see me when I go to local courts, I had I'm like the worst. Bro, I'm gonna if someone out. if someone checks to me and I get a three, I'm like, come on, okay, okay, yeah. walk forward, walk forward. What do you play? Don't give me that much space. I play anywhere, but we usually play Lakemba or outdoor. We, yeah, Lakemba or Sydney, or we go to Yorme. You know Yorme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's one in Pats, though. My mate, was, my mate goes there and just throws up some shots. Yeah, it's like religious and that, but mm. you don't have to, like, you know, go for religion. You can just go play. Mm-hmm. It's an open court. And some of the gun players go there. Like, that, Bal- that Bawali guy has been there. Like yeah. All the guns, some of the guns have been there, yeah. But I want to verse some of those boys, hey. I'm going to rinse you. You won't. You actually won't. You get won't. someone, I'll get Baby Chol. <laughs> get whoever you want. Baby Chol's a gun. I'll, I'll get my mate. He's a good street ball player, too. I yeah. love his celebrations, I bro. think I've seen him before... At Lakemba or someone else like him at Lakemba because I seen a TikTok once and he was like shooting at Lakemba, it's like greening it. I was green, 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 whatever. I'm like, oh, piss off, bro, like, kitty, Who are you? I love his taunts, bro. Yeah, I know. He done one that was so funny. He um, I mean, he did like a tough layup. Yeah. He gets the spirit, <laughs> and then he puts it on the floor and he yeah. stomps on it. It's, oh, Smoking it's the funniest on that thing. Yeah, funniest yeah. thing. But I was saying the other day, bro. I wish like if I could go back to when I was a baby. Yeah. Let's pick one sport to play. Like basketball. Basketball. Yeah, I know. He's, I love it. Besides, besides footy, bro, I play basketball. And to be honest, I'm not gonna lie to you. Past four weeks, I've been in this golf journey. Golf? Learning how to play golf. With who? By Friends? myself. Really? I swear to God, I go to the drive every Friday. My day off, I go to the driving range. Golf's addicting, bro. Go to the driving range. I just dove into it head first. I got like, I'm like you know, what? I'm gonna go get golf clubs. Got it from um, uh, eBay. Two hundred and eighty bucks. Seriously. Bro, rocked up to Bankstown. The guy's like, "Oh, this is the golf clubs." Explain it to me. I'm like, mm, "Hmm." I don't know what he's talking about. I'm like, I'll take him. <laughs> and I've been going every Friday. You just hit it. Sh- I'm grinding, bro. My hands are all blisters. What the fuck? I swear to God. It's I'm so grinding. addictive. Harry got into golf. Yeah. Harry's been into golf. Yeah. And, bro, he'll go like every Saturday, without a doubt. And then go after work and hit the driving range. Bro, I'm doing that every Friday. That's don't even care. Game. I don't want to go out anymore. I just want to go play. You just need time for it, but. Bro, if you see my folder, I have a folder on my golf journey. I started so bad. And today I'm like cleaning them. Have you done lessons? Any lessons? Nah. Just find myself. Mark, one of the gym that I work at. One of the guys there, he's like early 40s and he's like one of my best mates now. Yeah. And he's teaching me how to play. And like I always send him videos. I'm like, oh, how is this? How? I'm like a little kid, like playing footy again. That's the best like, thing about working somewhere, eh? like at a, not a casual job, but just yeah. with people all different walks of life. When I was right. lifeguarding, I was friends with like, her name's Kim. Yeah. 30 something year old mum, four yeah, kids, yeah, yeah. Exactly. besties, bro. Besties. Bro, do you know there's people at my gym? My gym is full of millionaires. Swear to God. What gym you work at? Redline, Redline Fitness, okay? Sylvania and like, I was oh, like that's why I'm really nice brother I've never been exposed to these people like it took me a while obviously like being a Lebo in such a white area for me to, for them to take me in yeah and then 
bro, I'm finding out all these people's lifestyles and this person has a yacht and this person does this and this person has a house on the water. I'm like, all right. We're in such a bubble. <laughs> bro, I'm like, because when I first got there, I'm like, who the, like, who the fuck trains at 5 a.m. in the morning like, for a group class? I'm like, what spinners? I would never do that. I'm yeah. getting paid to do it. I wouldn't do it. But then when you start talking to these people, these are the people that are successful and they have money. They wake up early. There's like this 5 a.m. rule. Mm. Apparently it's like, this thing on the internet, it's like a 5 a.m. club. If you wake up 5 a.m., you train, you do this, and you're doing it all before people are awake, you know? Yeah. yeah. But, bro, these people are like in, like, they have memberships with these golf courses that they're like 100, 100 grand a year. So I knew, I, I talked to someone about that. I was like, I swear I've heard they're 100 there's grand. One, there's one called the Australian, and it's like the most prestige golf course in Australia. Mm. Apparently, it's like uh, maybe like fifty to a hundred thousand a year. What are you getting off that? Are you getting like a blow or something every time you get there, bro? I don't know what they're getting. I don't know what they're getting, but I'll fucking sell my kidney now to sign up to it. Hundred grand a year, but imagine, 100. imagine. Apparently, the course a, is just nice. Imagine getting the membership there and like the people you're exposed. Exactly. To. Imagine the connections that you have. Exactly. They're like uh, companies and business and this and that. She's looking to get a job there. Bro, um, one of, there's a guy in my gym and he's like maybe 70 or uh, late 60s, early, I'll say late 60s or 50s. I don't know what he is, but he's old, okay? And he's like one of my best mates as well. And he has a membership there. Bro, 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 bro. Can he take you? I'm going to ask him. <laughs> I'm going to ask him. I'm just been practicing. I'm going to be practicing, practicing, practicing. But um, yeah. Like golf's addictive. Golf. Bro. Golf is the way to go. Bro, you know, when I, when I, I haven't even like, fucking played a game yet. I went to Rebel. You haven't done like a nine hole thing? Nah, nothing. Bro, go to Stefton. Bro, I went and got a fucking Under Armour shirt, glove. I got you the ho- I got all the gear with no idea, you brother. Are you like that in basketball too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I play basketball, I'm just letting you know, I wear a shirt and sleeve, headband, wristband. Whatever you want. Jersey, shorts, long socks and wear shoes. Wear the thing that Benji Marshall used to wear for more balance as well to help you. It's not going to happen. Yeah, bro, I'm telling you, I'm going to rinse you. Wear whatever you what want. What are you good bro? at? You shoot, I'm a sh- I shoot threes and I can drive and I'm... I'll fucking stick to you like shit. What? Like, I'm, not, I'm, I'm a defensive wo- player. No, 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 no. Honestly. <laughs> Listen, when we used to, all these players that you're seeing now coming up in like the ranks in NBA? like basketball, no, 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 <laughs> no, yeah, like the ones that are going to the park in Sydney and that. Yeah, yeah. I swear to God, you know that video that just came out? They just released yeah. it. I think it was Take Flight a, or some, yeah, yeah. something on Instagram. They just released it on the TikTok. American guy came. Yeah, that's right. All the guys that were in playing in that, I versed them, bro. We played them against them in Nawi in, uh, in Pika's Park. Yeah. Pika's Park, bro, oh, they always yeah, come. No, no one. Yeah, it's a shittest court, but everyone used to go then hang out. Just a half court? Yeah, just a half court. Bro, I versed all of them. Like, I know, like, I'm not, I'm not trying to You're say. actually good? No, nah, I'm good, bro. Walla? No, Walla, bro. Walla. I want to play. Who do you play with now? I just play with my mates, but some, most of the time, we used to go a lot, but now, like, just on my days, I'll go shoot around and- What time do you, like, get together and play? Or days? Just yeah. whenever we're free. It's not, we're not consistently. Me up then, because I want to come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember when I I'll told you? Remember, remember when we said? Remember when we said that, we're going to go? Yeah, yeah. And then I'm like, to, um, East Hills. Yeah, East Hills. East Hills, East Hills I don't like the floor, though. You don't like it? No, nah, I don't like that. Uh, I like Sydney though. I love indoor. Oh, you Sydney? Well, hey, little, I rock up. I haven't been to them. I get out of the car and like I have my hoodie on. I'm like, who's gonna fucking get eaten? Today? Does it look like my like my park in that? At Sydney? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like Sydney's mad. Yeah, yeah. Like it's, it's like it's like two full courts, but everyone plays half court, half court, half court. Yeah, man. This game's going. Oh, you just game. Been to Liverpool? Nah. I used to play there when I was younger. That's three courts, but there's fucking always a rim broken or some shit. Is it? But it used to be good pickup games I, there. I hate playing games now if the fucking um the net isn't on properly. Oh it just gives God. me anxiety. Yeah, I hate it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to hear it. Oh, hear I'm it. not gonna lie. I'm not the best shooter, but everything else I'll rinse you. Walla, bro. Walla, walla. Like, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm a freak. We'll play. I'm a freak. I'm a freak. Get whoever you want. You know what? Get, you know what you can do? You can go get two players, and I'll get two players, and we'll clean you. Play three on three. Play three three. I'm gonna get two good players, bro. Now get whoever you want. Get whoever you want. Uh, hey, you know, don't fucking do a felon now. Go get Nick Curios. I don't know no, who you're no, gonna get no, for no, me. No, no. I won't get baby child. I'll get two of my mates. I'll yeah, just get two your mates. Get two your mates. But they're good. But um, you know why basketball is so good, like better at this age? Because, bro, we can't just go to the park and play a game of footy. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, like yeah, people yeah. just... And touch just doesn't... Uh, touch is actually, I like touch. Oztag yeah. doesn't do it for me. No. Oh, you know what? Uh, no. Oztag as well? He good? <laughs> he as good as like Tien, you know Tien? Come on, man. Come nah, on. Seriously. Don't start with me. Tien and Rad one. Come on. They're my boys. They're my boys. Nah, but Tien's come on. Come on. Gun. Come on, bro. Come on, come on. Nah, not Tien. Come I'm seeing Tien tomorrow. I'm going to ask him. Ask him. I'm going to ask him. Ask him. Tian, Tian, you know, Tian. You like Oztag? I don't like it. You know what? When I was when I was playing rugby league, right, and there's a lot that happened with that, and I was trying to make it, and blah 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 blah, right. And then, but rugby league's so hard to make. But when you play the Oztag, bro, I walk into the like, <laughs> I sound like the cockiest prick ever. But Oztag, I jump on. I'm the best player in Australia in my yeah, head because you it 
Do you just have those ball skills and you don't have to bro, think about it like that? Nah, do I don't like. But are you good at the turning and the hips? Yeah, and that? yeah. Is like, that stuff I struggle, bro? Bro, we like we we verse all the best players. Like it's a shit comp in Perry Park in Lakemba. Some of the gun players come down, and we're actually going. I'm going to Ireland. We're gonna go play the World Cup. What that? Did you know, so no, 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 no. Don't worry about that. Um, I'm playing the World Cup for Ireland. What for who? In Ireland for Lebanon. Oh, you're playing the Lebanon team. The World Cup, yeah. And you know Lebanon team stack. Good team. All star team. It's Unbeatable. Good. Oh, so you actually play reps in that? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Keep yeah up. Are you going to stay cup in that? Yeah, yeah. The, the most recent state cup is coming up in a month. I'm not going because I'm going to have to take off time off work and I, don't, I can't do that. Mm. So I'm going to wait until I go to Ireland, which is going to be the beginning of August. Yeah, I'm shit. I was taking we had a, Bro, we had a fucking Ireland. trial. What, is it paid for? You pay for it. I think that um, he's getting sponsors for, us to, for them to pay for us. Yeah. I think we have to pay for it, but then he's going to kind of compensate it when he gets um, sponsors. But you played touch growing up? No, I was tag. No, I was tag. No, no, I played I played touch with the board like Brandon, Adam, yeah. Jacob. Like, yeah, that was crack up. No, nah. back sound jets. Yeah, fake uh, up on all like twelve. I always, I always used to see like people posting like back in the days when you know people used to play that. I used to think fuck like all the guns play it, you yeah. know, because like we like back in the days like like uh, Pappenhausen played it, Ponga played it, like, like all the gun I footy players played yeah, it. Yeah, I feel like the people who play touch but don't really Even get like into Jack, tag. You know Jack that Jack? we played footy with. Jack, 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 Jack Ryan. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So like all yeah, those Aussie yeah, boys, yeah, all touch. the East Hills yeah, boys, yeah. they played. East Hills like, were good at touch, bro. Yeah, were they? School, yeah, yeah. I remember them. Always. I remember all those boys played touch, but I never played. That was like their school sport. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Never did that, bro. Never. I just, I was so fucking obsessed with trying to make it to footy eight. Yeah. Oh, bro. You, I was like, do you wish you could like redo it? Bro, I just had the unlucky. I feel like I had the unluckiest time. You had a lot of injuries, did you? Nah, just like she just didn't go my way. If I explain, I have stories for days where shit just didn't go my way. And if something went differently, I feel like I could have made it. Mm. But at the end of the day, I just, I'm not going to be that person. I'm just going to say like, I wasn't good enough. But it's just something like, fucking, you know, if that happened, th what, what could have been said, you know? I was too lazy. You're too lazy? <laughs> that was mine, yeah. Bro, I, like, know it. I was fucking obsessed. Like, I swear to God, like, low key, low key, I was actually like making myself crazy trying to make it. I went all out to make 20s. You didn't yeah. stop too. You keep going to like, normally people drop off like me. I realized I was about 16. Yeah. All right, it's not happening. Yeah. I was yeah. too lazy doing the wrong things. Yeah. It's not going to happen, but I just kept playing. Bro, I was, you, like, I was a spinner. I was a spinner. I was like, nah, I'm not going to have, I didn't have you V. You to about 20. I didn't have V till like two years ago. V? V and Red Bull Energy. That disciplined. I swear to God, ask all my mates. I didn't have V. I'm like, nah, you know, it's gonna like, not going to fuck, it's going to fuck me up. It's going to do this and it's going to do that. Still to now, I haven't touched Algeria before. Never, Seriously. swear to God, never did drugs, never drank, never did this, never did that. Always Saturday night when the game would be on Sunday, my mates would be like, "Oh, let's go to a restaurant." Still till now? Ah, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got some VC. It looks like you got some VC and you upgraded. <laughs> I turned into lemon. I went crazy. Yeah. I went crazy. My fault. <laughs> Once it was done, it was done. <laughs> it was done. <laughs> um, yeah, bro. Fuck. I don't know. Like Saturday night, back in the days in the back in the days in the spot, you know, Liverpool. Mm, Everyone yeah. used to go to the spot. Fuck, let's go to the spot Saturday night. We, I used to go with Jeff. Bro, oh Jeff? Yeah. Nah. I mean Jeff all the time. Fuck, Jeffrey Allen? Yeah. Shit. Yeah. That's, a, that's a big throwback, bro. Yeah, fuck, everyone used to go, and I'm just like, nah, I can't. Saturday night, they all used to be like, nah, Ali can't come out. Like, you know, they're all going out to the restaurant, they're going to do this. What did I used to do Saturday night? I used to go to Rache's, I used to go to Pasta, I used to go home, I used to get my foam roller, foam roll, foam roll, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, stretch, go to the petrol station, walk there, get three bags of ice, 10 bucks, put them in my water tank outside, I had this weird position of getting in my water tank and I used to ice bath for like five, ten minutes. You were proper, proper. Oh, I swear to God, proper, proper. After that, go inside, like bundle up, you know, chuck some um, clothes on, uh, watch TV, go to sleep early, have a game Sunday. So what, what, what club were you doing that at? Like when was this? When were you that playing? That was... So you played Bass Broncos, yeah, me. Well, you played Bass Broncos. Who was yeah, I playing for at that played, time? St. John's? We played together for one year, I think, at Bass Broncos when you were... Or maybe you left. No, I never, I never played Bass Broncos. You didn't? No, I played St. John's. I know we had Red. I had Red. That's when we, we, we versed you. Did you have like that, that big Matt guy? Was nah. in your team? Yeah, 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 yeah. My son. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, don't even get me started about that fucking semi final we had against you when at Moorbank when Brandon. Oh, we won. Brandon, all try. right, fucking doesn't play the whole season, comes the last game. Glock and goes crazy. Bro, that's probably one of the best halves combo bro. in, in the full <laughs> dogs comp. Brandon and Nabil, I don't know, six bro, and seven. That game, like, we, like, we versus during the year and we won, right? And that game, I'm just, we had, our team was stacked. We yeah, had like, oi, Buller, 
That second round of saying till now, uh. till now, I still think he will go to the NRL and just put a shot on. Mm. Bullet was brazy. I don't know. Bullet was something else. <laughs> had like Bullet, and we had fucking like I can't remember if we even had Ben Sapati or that was like, in our team. Was he in your team? Yeah. Yeah. But at, at one point, you had a good team. At one point, we had the whole Bulldogs team. I can't remember from who Amos they are. to yeah. Jacob to Adam to me to. Um, some Brad Abbey's brother. Yeah, you had a good team. What the fuck was his team? We had all the f- the uh, hood rats. Yeah, all the spinners. I went to school with all the spinners. But brother, I'm telling you, any team you put us against, like up against, yeah. first 15 minutes, we'll beat them. Yeah. After that's when we died out. Yeah. Our team, bro, we're all partying Saturday night. I know, I know, <laughs> bro. That game, that game, like, everybody, like, there was like talk before the game. I was Brandon on playing. I don't give a fuck, bro. Was, like Brandon, I knew Brandon was gun, right? Like yeah, everyone knows then. Brandon's gun. It's you know? just like. Chest it was just like. chatter like fucking Tui was going in para, you yeah. know, shit like that. Yeah. Just like everyone knew of everyone. And then Brandon rocks up. But in that game, I actually played well. I remember that game, I scored two tries, right? And I'm like, fuck, you know, this is going well, blah, 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 blah. And then Brandon just fucking, you know what it was? The game was so tight. I still remember this play exactly. Me and Pule had this play, right? And me and Pule, automatically we score if we do this play. It's like the Billy Slater play, right? Some, the halfback gives it to Pule. I start on his right side. And he'll run straight, he'll bounce off his left, and I come off his hip. Yeah. I swear to God, Nabil, I swear to God, we've done this place. It's like a tight part in the game, second half. We've done that play, and I went straight through. And I'm like, fuck, no one's going to catch me. And I see fucking Brandon chasing me, and the fucking cunt got me. <laughs> I gassed the full, I got around the fullback. Brandon got me. Played the ball, uh, shift, 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 and we drop it. I remember they uh, used either did a long pass or a kick, something. and that guy Paul, got, Paul, I think his name was Paul. Some, some, Island some, the kid dropped Island, it. Island, Island yeah. he dropped it. Remember? Yeah. In the right corner. Yeah. You should have. There oh, was hey, no one in front of him. There you. was no one there. <laughs> oh, you know that. You know, uh, after the game, he comes like say, "Oh, good game, boys." Everyone looked at him like that. Like, didn't want there was no doing. one in front of him. Oh, I, and thought, and I thought I thought all for money is gonna score when he I, dropped it. I, I, like, oh. I take it back. I and I always take it back to that fucking tackle Brandon did. I'm like, fuck, if he didn't chase me, bro, I was on. Yeah. Played the ball quick turn blah, 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 and he dropped it. I remember and that. I'm like, fuck, that's what you, I knew it was. You gone. know what I remember that about that game? Conor McGregor versus uh, the pub, Nate DS2. The pub at the, at the, pub. the top, yeah. You could see it when we were on the field. And me at that time, <laughs> big McGregor stan. <laughs> yeah. His biggest fan yeah. since day one. And yeah. bro, I remember you guys scored on us. You probably scored. And we're in the um the dead ball line we're talking yeah. I'm fucking watching at the pub <laughs> and everyone's standing yeah. like, oh Mugoku just yeah. dropped him yeah, like yeah, he yeah. just came out yeah, in the yeah, first yeah. or second round and the, the, co- that the was trainer like, was off me he's like shut the fuck up and focus yeah. on the game yeah. semi final big fob trainer yeah Brenton's brother yeah, he's yeah, good yeah. he's a good guy yeah, but yeah. you know I was, should have been focusing on the game I was watching it yeah bro and I scored a try off a kick yeah yeah Lucas yeah, yeah. try yeah, yeah I'll yeah. never score tries <laughs> <laughs> no but that was a good game that was proper like Peak Conor McGregor that time. Yeah, it was. And that was peak park footy, bro. I swear to God. Yeah, yeah. That was a good bro, year. Bro, so bro. fun. You just end up going, I think, against Holy Cross and lost. We lost in the grand final, yeah. Against Holy Cross. I remember that. Yeah. It's like, too, they were too fit. Holy too. Cross even has players that are gun to Like, they had, they had gun players then that are still playing now. Mm. Like, in, like, New South Wales Cup and stuff. There's like... But I reckon our players at the time were better, bro. But it's just, obviously they're more disciplined. They yeah, yeah. worked harder. They like, kept going. Whatever happened to Society? I remember Society that was in the Bass Broncos. A gun know. player? Going to Westfields? Yeah. I don't know. Freak player. Like, we had so many freaks. I love like, freaks. Bro, like, this, bro, like, we used to, the fuck, that Bulldogs teams that we had, like, in development, the freakish team you ever see, but just everyone went there. Bro, I always there, say it. There, footy's like there. the longest journey. Like, it doesn't stop at how that's, why it's, that's, that's, why it's props, that's why it's props to Brandon, bro. Like, he's stuck at it. Yeah. You know? Like, out of all the guns that were around him. In an environment where everyone went... Yeah, hey, why are yeah, yeah, yeah. He stuck at it, man, and he was around all of those like bad people, like you know. But fuck, man, he came through, like he made it out, like you know. And ev- I think everyone kind of knew that he was gonna be like a gun. It was, yeah, he was ever because it kind of like playing like fucking. It wasn't even like up. physical uh, ability. It, it was, was the just, smallest player. This is more. I don't know. Small. I swear to God, we used to be in Bulldogs, right? Like I still remember this, and we used to go have de- development games against like um, Penrith and stuff like that. And like the biggest fucking cunt used to run at him at the, off the kickoff, and he's the smallest player. Wahiyat or like dropping him, dropping him, Good dropping time, him, right? dropping him. And I bet he used to fucking break everything in his body, but he just didn't ever used to show it. Do you watch much basketball? Uh like yeah, I do, I do. I, I keep I keep up with it, but I'm not I'm not gonna say I watch fucking every game. Who do you like the most? Like who's your team or player? Bro, coming up, I was the biggest like Russell Westbrook stan. Like the mm, biggest. He got me into it too. Oh bro, Russell Westbrook. OKC okay, Russell Westbrook? Yeah. My favorite. 
My favorite. Back from the James Harden and Kevin Durant days. Yeah. Back in those days. And then even more when KD left. Even more when KD left and the banter they used to, like, the, you know, the, the stuff that they had used to go it's on. Like when they, it was him against the world. It was him against the world and he got MVP. Yeah. I know it was stat padding a bit, yeah. you know, average tri- triple double and stuff like that, but still, fucking gun. Yeah. Gun. But favorite player is Russell Westbrook, but I, I'm, I'm like a LeBron fan. I like to hear it. I'm, I'm a LeBron fan. I like I'm a LeBron fan. I honestly am. I'm not, I don't go for Lakers. But I'm a LeBron fan. I just appreciate greatness. Like I think he's a gun, and I've thought that since he was in Miami. Like I, when I was in Miami, I really got onto that train hard. Mm. But I don't understand the the LeBron hate. I don't get it. People do, people like to punch up, not down. <laughs> they, don't, they don't appreciate greatness, bro. Bro, I don't understand it. I, I think he's a fucking freak. I just think he's a freak, and I think he's better than Jordan, to be honest. I think he's better than Jordan. So do I. Well, like it's hard. I'll debate anyone under that he is, but <laughs> different era. Because do you use a freaking beard like kit or something? A beard kit? Yeah. Nah, I. You know what? How it was? the fuck is it so even? And <laughs> there's no patches. I got. I got. I got. I got to plug my barber, <laughs> my cousin. No, but um, I actually did laser today. I did laser. Yeah. I did laser here and here. That's why I'm a bit bubbly. Like yeah. I did laser literally today, but I fucking just I use a beard oil. But has it always been like, did it start patchy? Because mine's freaking patchy here and here. It like, started patchy. But I had a beard from like fucking year nine. Like. And if you keep growing it, will it grow over the patches or do you have to keep shaving it? Nah, it, you got you to gotta like keep taking it off. Here, here I used to never like grow. You never used to connect that much really. But now it's proper. Bro, I'm fiending for one. Now I'm just, I look at everyone. I look down on everyone now. <laughs> it's a I nice look down beard. Bro, Straight out. Nice especially beard. like my cousin does like a drop fade into another fade. I'm like, yeah. Bro, I swear, That's what I'm I, trying to get. I walk out of there like the fucking And man. you got that curly hair too. Come on. Talk to me. That curly talk to hair. me nice. Come did on. your eyebrows with the razor or I do, or but wax them? unfortunately this week I didn't do the slit. Yeah, it's gone over. It's yeah, gone my, my barber's like, you know, we've got to give it a week or two, let it grow back so it can be sharp. I'm like, you know, I'm going to sacrifice. So, Are you going out this weekend? Huh? No, no, no. No going out. I don't, I don't even go out. No. never been clubbing. Really? Never. I've hardly been. I've been a couple times lately, but... Not for me. What I, about when you went, to, you went to Bali, didn't you? Bro... Why is it the freshest thing ever? Is it, is it good? Bro, it's gun. Like, you know what? When I went to Bali, I had the idea to to go to these day clubs. I'm like, I want to suss them out. Mm. I want to suss them out, the day clubs. So uh, I'm like, all right, first week I did it like the chill Bali. Like, you know, just to kind of cruise it and do all the touristy stuff. Quad biking and stuff? Yeah, so quad yeah. biking and... Um, Big swing and I don't know what, man, all of that shit, you know, you have to do Stuff it. for Insta. You have to do it. Stuff for Insta. <laughs> yeah. Stuff for me, I do it for the people. Yeah. You know, show them what's going on. Yeah. Ah, you know, I have fucking 300 followers. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I'm acting like a fucking Kylie Jenner. All right, guys, this is what we have for breakfast today. Floating breakfast. He's vlogging. <laughs> vlogging, bro. It was proper, but. Good memories, yeah. Oh, you're so mad. It was like fucking so hot. First week was all hot. Second week, I oh, shit you not, bro, raining every 40 minutes. Seriously. And that's the day, there's, that's the times I wanted to go to like Finns Beach, Potato Head, like all of these clubs. Didn't get to go to any of them. Didn't get to get over. And then, and then, bro, I got Bali Belly. Do you remember on my Instagram, I put up a post on the story. I don't know if you remember, but it was of Maccas there. Oh, I can't remember. Bro, I put it, I got Maccas there. I'm like, I'm going to try it. Maccas got you Bali Belly. Are you joking? What the fuck is that? Like, I thought it was meant to be like. I'm doing like this whole like. You know, I'm gonna stay away from drinking ice because I say ice from water sometimes, this and that. Like eating shit food, no straight food ever. Or proper food. I'm like, I'm gonna get Maccas on the way from Seminyak to Uluwatu. You think that's safe? Bro, you think that's safe, right? Maccas, Maccas. they got workers there, they exactly. got regulations. I'm a fucking idiot. I've never had a McSpicy here. I've never had that. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go Bali and have one. It's but. Bro, here. that's what I thought here. Yeah, I'm on, I've never had one. I went there, I got a McSpicy. The fucking lettuce, they wash it with the water there and you can't have the water there. You reckon that's what it is? Oh my, you know that's what? how hard you were thinking about bro, tracing it back? I swear to God, I ate, and I ate, pro- like I ate a lot, bro. Like a cheeseburger, triple cheeseburger, fucking McCh- uh, McSpicy, everything. And on the, I was on the taxi, I'm like, Fuck, what's going on? Straight after. Straight after, like straight in. And I'm like, bro, I got to the I got to the villa or whatever the resort. And then I'm like, no, nah, it's not feel like I don't feel good at all, man. And then bro, give it like an hour or two. I haven't vomited since I was six years old. I swear to God in the view. I haven't vomited. I don't vomit. I don't I just don't do it. I don't like the sensation of it. Mm. Whenever it comes up, push it back down. Push it back down. Push it. I don't do it. I don't ever 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 do it. Unless one time. One time when yeah, I was in year eleven. Big Fono, night. Fono, Fono, and this one to get me. Uh, I, don't know what, I don't know what Fono did to me. <laughs> I thought I could mash it with the fobs, but yeah, nah, like, you like, can't. <laughs> I learned that. <laughs> yeah, that was the only time. 
And then, um, and, and on that time, I was choking on the vomit. It didn't come out. Yeah. It didn't come out. Bro, bro, I'm there, like, ugh, vomiting. And I'm, like, crying. <laughs> Snot come down. I'm hitting the wall. I'm screaming at the vomit, like, it can go away. I'm uh, like, please, stop, stop. Like, and I'm, bro, oh, and, like, you're, like, that angle and out of there. And you actually think it's from the, the washing of the lettuce. You know, I didn't think that until I, I couldn't do it. I couldn't even do medicine. I, had, I got a doctor came to my bed. Swear to God, I was in my undies. I was in my undies like that, and the doctor came put me in a, a UV drip. Seriously, Voila. he gave me a UV drip and put it up, and he just and he's like, "Oh, I'm gonna leave this in for 20 minutes. Like, drink it all up through your vein, whatever, and I'm gonna sit outside." And he just goes, "It's sit on WhatsApp." Who did you call? Like, is there? A I call the uh, the resort. You tell the resort to call the doctor. I wonder how many times they get that call. Oh, 100 percent. You're gonna make a killing if yeah, you're a doctor in Bali. Seven hundred bucks for the UV drip. Yeah, seven hundred bucks for him to come. Lucky I got travel insurance. Before I go, I never ever get travel insurance. Why the fuck am I going to get travel insurance? Yeah, I would I always go to Lebanon, bro. You fucking get shot in the leg. How much Anything? is travel insurance? Um, you just pay, uh, it's like 250 A Oh, cracker. Yeah, 250 just for, just for like excess. You know what? I hate buying insurance and stuff like that. But you know what I love? is yeah. when I do buy it and I use it. Bro. And it's not a waste. What I, a I couldn't wait until the doctor went so I can put my claim through. I, put my claim <laughs> I through. went to the Red Hot Chili Peppers the other night. Oh, personal loan? Because I bought a ticket and... I got ticket insurance for six bucks. I was like, you know what? You fucking never know. There's COVID. Nah. My first concert ever. 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 Wow. Ever. Ever. I was like, with COVID and shit. Like, I don't know. I just, they're unreliable. They're old. I didn't use it. I was burning. I paid that six bucks. Well, you didn't go to the concert? No, no, I went. But like, oh, I, I know <laughs> I paid that six bucks for no reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. But bro, Bali's like, like can be proper weird, man. Yeah. Bali can be proper weird if you're not like with scams and... Really? Fucking people asking you, do you want Viagra? Do you want this? <laughs> do you want that? I'll tell you what, I never ever do drugs. Never. I just, it's not me. But I like, you know, I don't mind, you know, like if you go on a holiday, just have a quick a little, smoke. Just a little smoke, just yeah. a chill. Yeah, I'm yeah, just yeah, like yeah. that. Yeah. But then everyone's just like, oh, like you can't do it in Bali because, you know, Ch Chappelle Corbin, yeah. they'll fucking put you in Vlong of the Murder apparently or some yeah, shit yeah, like you that. You can't do drugs there. And then, bro, I've never been asked for so much drugs. Like if I wanted that drugs, like when I was there. Even weed and that? Everything. You want Viagra? I no one has. Do you want uh, Valleys? Do you want... Um, By who? Who's asking? People, taxi, uh, like people bar, on the like street. Balinese people. Locals. I swear to God, I learned that. I learned the language. I learned the language there. Every time, because when you when you book the, the fun stuff to do, I just speak to the people. And I just I try to learn the language as much as I could and people freak out. They're like, so how long have you been How long have you been living here? Seriously. I'm just like, oh, I've been here for a couple of days and they freak out. Is that where you got your tattoos? Yeah, I got these two. These two there. When was your first one? First one was this one, and how like how old? This you? one, this one. Oh, last year, I never wanted to get tattoos. I always got scared. Plus, it was like a footy thing. I don't know. It was just all weird. Plus the family. How Plus did you get away with that one? <laughs> yeah, all my family has tattoos. Really? Yeah, they all have tattoos. Islamic, yeah. Yeah, the Islamic family, yeah, but they all have tattoos. Ah. Yeah, so but like, there's just they just get in places that it doesn't show. I don't want to get some, eh? bro. And then once you get one, yeah, it's over. They get Are you going to keep going? Yeah, it's done. It's done now. Now this is all here. It's going to start. I like the sticker stuff though. Yeah, so do I. I started off, oh, like, I want to give this meaning, this meaning. What? Brother, I'll get a fucking, <laughs> I'll get a fucking potato now. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> I'll get an apple here. It suits you, bro. I'll get an apple. God. Now it's just, now I'm just going brazy with it. What the fuck's the butterfly for? But I got that for my sister. Okay. okay. And this is just coordinates to the village that I'm from in Lebanon. Oh yeah, okay, okay, it looks really cute. So we go crazy with it, you know? And a the sword. A, an evil eye. Patience. Uh, patience. I'm the most impatient person, I don't know why I got that. Um, the sword just like looks, looks patience gun. Patience as a reminder. <laughs> yeah, patience as a reminder. Just. What about the thing on the, the Roman numerals? That's my dad, dad's birthday. Everything is temporary, just shit like that. And then these two, I'm just like, look, gun. Bro, I swear to God, I've been thinking about it hard. I don't know why, just to Bro, I'm telling you now. Like everyone needs to tell me if you get one, you know. So I'm like, fuck you. Like, don't tell me what to do. Like, I'm not gonna get any more. Don't regret it. What now, bro? I'll I'll gonna keep going. You know why I feel like I've been thinking about it because my arm's getting a little bit bigger. I've never really had oh, muscles and that. Fuck I feel yeah. like I'm like looking all right. Yeah, I never yeah. felt like that really. Like yeah. that much. What's oh, been going on with the gym, bro? What's going on? Are you going on a lot, a lot now? A lot of time on my hands. The most important question: What's the split? What? Oh, bro. Is it just whatever? I just fucking train. <laughs> <laughs> I just train. I just. That's like, like I'll that's, do chest and That's the worst thing to hear If you're a trainer Like if you're a PT I'll just do Oh yeah I should ask you for some that's, advice That's the worst thing for me All right. So my um, Situation Is A I've got four days to train in a week Yeah Really I don't train yet for three days Can't Yeah 
Four days to train in the week. Um, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Wednesday, you know on Friday. Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. I've been right. doing like Wednesday. Sometimes I'll go in the morning. Otherwise, I got lunch mm. at work, which is half an hour. So it's a quick half an hour session. Mm. And then I was going after, like at night time as well. And then two sessions in one day. Yeah, at, at a stage. Yeah. Oh, proper. Yeah. Um, Thursday, I would go at lunch, and then sometimes at night time. Mm-hmm. Friday in the morning with my friend. Sometimes at night time, and then Saturday in the morning. Fuck twice so a day. Like most sometimes, of the time. yeah. Jeez, like it's good. When I was taking. Have you done a scan? A scan. Body scan. No. See how much muscle mass, muscle mass, muscle mass you have. No. Body fat percentage. No, nothing. It's good. Yeah. So I say I got four the four sessions <laughs> in a week. What should I split? If I was you, like I know some people, even though they're not playing footy, it's so like for example, you're not playing footy anymore or whatever. Yeah, you don't like to keep people don't like to do cardio. I, I want to look. I want to look thicker. Like thicker? I want to get thick. I don't want to get so lean. Are you willing thick. to do like cardio and stuff? Here and there a little bit. I'd rather play basketball or something. Play basketball. But like I want to look thick. Yeah, and like get bigger legs and that. But I want to look thick, not too thick. But you know, I don't want to get massive. I don't want to get so muscular. Yeah, I just want to yeah. get thick and fit. Yeah. To be honest, like I understand because I. I used to have such a different mentality because people used to go, like people go to the snaps and the crunches and all of these gyms or a gold gym, world gym, whatever the fuck they go to. Like, and they do the, all the like isolation, like machines and stuff, like all the like machines that you see, yeah. right? But now that I'm, I'm doing group training, it's so different, right? Group training is just everything. It's just mad. Like, like fucking mad tiring too. Oh, eh? bro, like it's hard. It's yeah, hard. Like the cardio that. days, nah, nah. But the split that I would do now, knowing from what I've like, you know, I've been working with and stuff. I do a push, I do a pull, I do a, I do a leg session. And then me personally, I do like an outdoor session, like um, some heels or some like, you know, because I have free weights that I just keep in the back but of the But how long car. is like your push and pull? How, how long is the session? How long is the session? Give me like 30, 40 minutes. Really? And you can yeah. do everything? 30, 40 minutes. Because you think about it, your push exercises are like your shoulders, your chest, your tries, your pulls, like your back, your buys, and then your legs is pure legs. But... You just got to make sure that... I know a lot of people are so scared to like deadlift. I speak to so many people. Yeah, I don't like deadlifting. Bro, like what's that? Like there's so many people that just don't know how to deadlift correctly so they're scared to do it. I got a shit like... I but it's like the, lower back. It's, it's one of the best exercises ever. I hit a PB For today, what? by For the way. What? By, by the what way. did you get? Or deadlift? I'm not even that much. I don't know what's good and what's yeah, not that's, good. Yeah, so I'm not going to... I'm, uh, I'm, I'm starting a strength program next week. So I, I got 160 today. Sounds like a lot. But I've seen people get like 200, 220, blah, blah, blah. It's hard. It's fucking hard, bro. Because if you don't do deadlifting properly, see you later. But is the risk to reward ratio worth it? I think it is, yeah. I think it's one of the best exercises. For what? To get stronger or bigger? A bit of both. It's a full body exercise. Like you're using, you know, like your hamstrings, your glutes. It's like a pull exercise. It's, it's literally like, cannot stress it enough, full body. Which day would you do it on the split? <sighs> um... So you're doing Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, right? So the four sessions a week, yeah. I do it on I do it on the I do it on the pool day, maybe pool day, because you do on your push day you do your the bench start, press at the end, middle, at the, at the start of the workout. You mean or end of yeah. the workout? To the start of the because it's such a big movement. You do it at the start of the workout, same as bench press. Mm. If you ever do bench press, you do it at the beginning of the workout because it exerts the most like energy. Why would you do fucking like flies or like chest or something else like on machine or something and then do bench press after when you're fucked yeah you start start with it first because it's going to take the most energy plus you got to warm up right so if you're doing push and you're doing bench press and then you're doing pull and you're doing deadlifts and then on the um legs that you're doing squatting it's, it's a good mix you know mm. it's a bit of everything but some people that just like to go and get a fucking party pump you do the <laughs> fucking do the same in your fucking room get sweaty do a couple yeah. push-ups same no, shit i don't know i just go and and do what I think I know. As, I, as, as working. Bro, like my cousin, my cousin, my barber as well, best body I've seen ever. I don't he know. He does hack, whatever. He does, <laughs> I swear to God, I call him and, and I guess I call him and I know I'm going to get ang- angry, but I still ask him. I'm like, what are you doing? He's like, oh, I'm training. I'm like, what are you doing? He goes, mm, you know, today I'm doing a bit of ropes, a bit of handstand push ups. I'm like, you motherfucker, get off, get off the phone. Bro, and I'm here like training my fucking asshole off yeah. to try to like look like, you know, vegan stuff. But I don't know. I feel like it's like consistency for, for me is the biggest thing. I've never really trained gym more than three months in my life straight. Yeah, consistency is most important. Are you taking protein? No. No? No. I tried a little bit of stuff. I think I just, just go with this like standard way. It's just the best for recovery. I'm not protein. I'm talking about. I tried some Dino Balls for like a month and a half. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not talking protein. I tried it like my first two months into training just because I was like, you know yeah. what, I want a little head start. And I wanted to train because I was doing two days a week. Yeah. I wanted to do a quick recovery. Yeah. So I did a month and a half. Yeah. And brother, I was training two days, like 
every day two sessions. That's fucked. It was crazy. I've I never, was I've never ever touched any of that stuff, and I've never heard of that stuff. I don't know, like I don't know what's good, what's not. I've never like um, I've never learned about it. I could see how people get addicted because yeah. it feels so good. Oh man, I but have I friends. A, I just did a head start, and I was training like two days a week, two days. Two sessions a day. Yeah. Like three or four days. Yeah, yeah. And bro, like, just, like, I went from here to here. Come on. And then now I could just, you know, keep cruise. like keep consistent. Cruise, cruise. And that's it. I reckon. Well, I can see how people get addicted. Cause 100%. I reckon, I reckon. I'm too scared. I reckon there's so many players in the NRL that have, like, taken shit. Young. Right? When they were young. Yeah. And it's just, they've just kept it. Probably. Bro, there's so many players in the NRL that have done that, I reckon. It's a good head start, bro. Are you joking? There's, you look at some people and I'm like, how the fuck are they that big? Especially when they're in Harold Mats. Are you joking? Yeah. Especially if they're not Islander. <laughs> Especially if they're not Islander. If they're a wog or they're like Aussie and they like look big like that. Bro, there's a difference. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. All of us like look, okay. And yeah. then there's some fucking unit in the centres. Yeah. Wants to take my fucking head off. <laughs> and I'm like here with my headgear, like with my socks off, looking like a little rat. Yeah. Like, Would you ever do it now? I've thought about it a lot. But I just think it's cheating. I'm just not about that. Cheating to what? Just cheating in life. Very cheating good. the effort. I know yeah, a lot of way. I know I know a lot of people that take it now. Some of my close friends, and I respect it. I don't. I don't. I'm not against it. But if you take it, say you fucking take it. Yeah. If don't someone asks, say bro, you take it. Don't be a fucking rat and say no, no, I don't. Cuss. Yeah, yeah. Don't, you don't, don't deny it. You don't deny it. Just no. say you fucking take you it. You don't have to go around saying. I've never really said it before. That's the first time. But like, bro, don't go around saying no, no, I'm natty. I fucking like hate people that say. Nah, Carl's natty, natty, natty. Nah. Natty your fucking head, bro. Who cares, bro? As long as Who cares? you're not competing. What does anyone care? No, if you're not competing, the way I see it, people like to, when they go out, right? Yeah. You're taking a drink because you want to have fun. Yeah. Is that cheating? Yeah. You, know, you take drugs because you want to have fun. Yeah. Is that cheating? You take exactly. vitamins because you want to stay healthy. Is that cheating? Exactly. It's exactly. something there. Like, I'm not going to get addicted. I'm going to take a little bit to just help me. Yeah. A little boost. Exactly. Why not? And I'm not competing, not playing sports. No, nothing dangerous for yeah. other people. I would, I would, I, I've, I'm not gonna lie. I've thought about it because really, in the PT, in the PT business, your body is like your business, right? Yeah. If I'm like overweight, or if I'm not looking well, or if I don't like look good, or whatever, right? I try to look good. I'm not like you know. I take care of myself. I don't com- compare to no one. But who's gonna who's gonna want to PT with someone that's like not taking their advice themselves? Yeah, you but know you what can I mean? do the extra. You can just like always yeah, be. Yeah, exactly. But that's what it's made me think. Like, oh, maybe if I took if I took that and I looked even bigger, and like, would I get more business? Or uh, I could, yeah, then I see how you think it's cheating. A hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. But like, like, thank God, knock on wood. Like, I'm going so well. Like, everything's going so well. I just I work hard, but it's it plays on your mind. Like, oh, what? Like, look at all these like trainers or people that have opened their gyms and that and they fucking look like units, bro. Mm. Like, they look like units, but. Is that what you want to do? You want to open up a gym one day? So I'm you, happy. What I'm are you doing? You studied? Right now, I, I studied the Bachelor of Physical Activity and Health Science. Yeah. And there's like people that do like the six month course to be a trainer and stuff like that. That's like normal ACP or the like colleges and stuff. And there's nothing wrong with that. People do that. But I studied I studied with the intention that I wanted to be a PE teacher. Yeah. And it's, I Didn't we all want to be a PE right, teacher? Everyone, oh, look how fun <laughs> it would be. And play footy with the kids. Yeah, fuck. <laughs> my dad was a PE teacher. Right. My mum was a, a primary school teacher. Everyone. I was also at my school. I was like, fuck, that's the life I want. Yeah, exactly, isn't it? <laughs> so it's not footy, that's that. Government job, and you get the holidays. School holidays, have kids. Weekends, exactly. this and that, you know? And I just but now you realise they don't get paid enough. <laughs> Bro, they don't get paid enough. Oh, it was so weird. Like, I've, I've been through the weirdest shit ever. I swear, like, I want... Halfway through, because I, t- I studied for so much longer than I needed to because I was playing 20s <laughs> yeah. and I just fucking forgot about and studying. Like two semesters, one se- sorry, right, one I was studying part time and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Because I was, you know, I was telling you, I was so obsessed with trying to make it. I fucking forgot about everything. I almost got kicked out like three times because I kept failing units and doing this and doing that. And at that point, nothing mattered to me besides making that fucking 20s team. I went fucking crazy. I swear mm. to God. I just wanted to make that 20s team. And um, yeah, and then I. And halfway through, towards the end, I'm like, oh, you know, it might be cool to be a PE, te- PE teacher because if I, w- sorry, if, or to be a PT, because if I wanted to be a PE teacher, I needed to do an extra two years. And at that point, I was, off, I, w- I didn't want to look at a book anymore. Mm. So at the end of it, I just had to do one extra unit and I was qualified to be a PT for my course, for my PT, yeah. But I didn't, when you have to do a placement, I did my placement as a PE teacher, just in case I wanted to go into PE teacher. How do you get that experience? Yeah, and I did at Liverpool Boys. Did you like it? 
Liverpool Boys was good. It's like not much different. Like it was the same as Punch Up Boys. Yeah. But did you like the teacher? A lot yeah, it was mad. It was yeah. pretty good. Yeah, my like teachers doing the vortex with them and this so and that. So important. I swear to God, I was actually yeah. talking about it with my mate today when we were driving home. Like having a good teacher or a couple of good teachers. I change your life. I swear to God, change your, your life. whole schooling experience, your outlook on life, like right. attitude coming to school. Then that affects who you're friends with, 100%. how you how you study, how you do everything. Like it's right. so important. I had a, I had a I had an English teacher for me seven or three or year twelve. The same one. She started when we started and she finished when we finished. She like resigned or something. And bro, like we, I've still had on Snapchat, still have on Instagram, still have a number. No, 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 no. She's just, bro, she's like that sister figure, eh? like mum, whatever. Like, like, even though we don't talk like anymore, but we used to find it weird. You like know, that, you know, we had Wilson. Oh, don't I actually spoke that to guy. Wilson on the phone today. No way. <laughs> yeah, just like random call, bro. Like, bro, I used to best. get, well, I used to always hear about him. All the fucking time from the Bass Boys. Just the best. They used to be so obsessed with him. Oh, Wilson, this Wilson. I'm like, who the fuck's this Wilson? <laughs> and then I saw him once. I saw him once. Um, uh, like we had like school sport versus Bass Hill. And then all the boys, all the Bass Boys were saying, oh, Ali wants to come to like Bass Hill and play footy with us. This and, that. and he like, first thing he ever told me, he goes, oh, are you going to come? And I go, oh, I don't know. I'm not sure yet. He goes, why? Well, he's scared of the, uh, he's scared of the sports schools to play footy with. I'm like, I'm thinking <laughs> you motherfucker. You motherfucker. <laughs> But I never knew what the hype was about him. What's so good about him? That's him. He chats shit. Like, his, bro, he made school enjoyable. Yeah. Like, a lot of those kids that came to the school wouldn't yeah. have been there if it wasn't for him. No way. One, he was a good coach. Like, actually, like all the excellence knows, like, very good coach. Yeah. Now I think he's doing Bulldogs development pathways. Yeah, yeah. But, like, the excellence knows for a long time, very good fundament fundamentals and all of that. Like, he made a lot of good players. Yeah. And obviously, a lot of them went off track, but. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> but there's a lot that went through Cash. that, you know. Yeah. That he coached for a long time. So the X's and O's. Who has he coached that are gun? Oh. That were gun. That uh, gun at the time. There's a lot of guns that both best players have ever seen, like Addison Demetrio and a lot of older people you wouldn't know. Addison were, Demetrio, is he like a... Is he like Italian Tongan? He yeah. played 20s for a bit for Manly and that. Did even he play... Even like that and he's he still... Addison is like... Um, did he play... Um, did he play for Newtown uh, New New Jets? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I used to invest my training. Fuck that, guys. You know the, How big was the university in Bar? Well, you know him? He's the definition of... All right, boys, we're going to do like... Um, uh, you know, tr uh, scrimmage like a training game, seventy percent. Yeah, all goes. I just run one hundred percent, run everyone over. How big was he when you first in bar? Oh, it's fucking big, bro. That's him. That is like physical condition is on the bad side. You should have nah. seen his brother when he was in his prime. He's a gun feet and like fastest big? player, best ball skills, kick goals, nah. like everything, well, like, everything. But uh, Brennan Santi, like a lot of players that went through the grades. So good coach, eh? All the footy. That he, he ran all of the footy, like literally everything at a public school. Yeah. He doesn't get paid extra. All our yeah. training, 7 a.m. in the morning. Like I remember. You got to go. I used to get so up. jealous. It's not a fucking. I used to get so jealous whenever you and guys we, used to have training. And we used to get jealous of like Westfield to have it in, in a class. Yeah. Yeah. But he's turning up on his own accord, bro, like three days oh, a bro. week, seven o'clock in the morning, yeah. organizing games while being a PE teacher. Yeah. Organizing games, organizing jerseys, washing, like literally everything, bro. Yeah. Like a full club for like four teams. Yeah. Once, once, when you guys had training and that, we, I used to play St. George with Harrow, yeah? Yeah. Harrow once gave me a bass singlet. That was like the holy grail for me. <laughs> Swear to God, I'd always wear it to school and I used to get told off all the time by the teacher, you can't wear that singlet here, blah, blah, blah. I used to think this was the coolest thing ever. Because everyone used to come to St. George Dragons training wearing it. I'm like, Fuck. that and like Westfield gear. Eh? Oh, bro. Like everyone used to like, Bro, I used to think that was the maddest cunts ever. Like, oh, yeah. I want to wear a bass singlet. Uh, he pretty much, bro, he provided like and banter parties to always like, you know, we used to always <laughs> have so much banter. Because like, we used to verse them, even though you guys used to verse them, I uh, used to play like uh, against Westfields and that in the comps. We used to verse bass in school sport. Mm. So I used to, to me. And we weren't there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we, were, so, we were training or doing something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Some of the gun plays never used to come, only like sometimes. Whenever you guys come, my head is like a grand final. Yeah. I'm like, fuck it. You gotta go your hardest. I gotta go hardest. Yeah. You gotta play the best. Yeah. So no, but he provided like a sports like school for experience a public, for a public school with no extra pay for a public school. That's fucking so sick. And for got for like kids like who couldn't afford it, couldn't you know, didn't make worse fields, but you still got that freaking environment, being around the boys, being around the training. Yeah, a public school in Bastille, you know. I reckon. I reckon there's a lot of people that still keep in touch with him. Hundred percent. Yeah, hundred. He's I mean, still he's, friends with half of us. He's probably changed so many people's lives, right? Like. And he used to keep us out of trouble, like the best of his ability. Obviously, there's only so much you can control. Yeah. He used to, you know, slap. 100 he goes to like, like a father figure to yeah, most yeah, yeah. Slap him if they need to, chat yeah, shit. But yeah, yeah, And I, I cool bet uncle. They, I bet they took that from him and not from other exactly. teachers. Exactly. Nah. Know? That wouldn't fucking listen to other teachers. He's probably like the fucking 
jackpot for that score, you know? You, bro, that score without him? See you later. Yeah, that's what I'm imagining, eh? It'd like, be like Punchball Boys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fuck, Punchball Boys. Fucking bad. Prison, I swear to God. That, that, that score was fucked. You know what? Back in these seven days, it was just... It, that whole fucking Punchball Boys experience was just so weird. It was just so weird. Year seven was just so weird. Like, that's when all the... Proper heavies used to go to the school and stuff. When you were year seven, yeah? Yeah, like there were some heavies. But like Mr. Dib was there. Do you know Jihad Dib? No. He's like the mayor of Lakemba. He's the mayor of he left. He left our school from principal to be going to politics. And he was like the one that changed the school, right? And he did. And when he left, it the school just got fucking weird. Shit. Just got weird. Just fucking weird. Like, bro, like those, the cops came to our school when I was like in year like 10, year 11. Thinking that we're having like ISIS meetings in the school. It was proper weird. So was that any of that true? No way, bro. No way. You know what it is? Because the school has like Friday prayers on every Friday in the school hall. So they have Friday prayers. And, and that, was, that was like when ISIS was <coughs> popping off. I, ISIS now <laughs> fell off. They fell off, bro. You know what? They don't need the distraction from ISIS. It's yeah. COVID now. Yeah, yeah. They, they yeah. fell off, bro. They fell off. It was, it was popping I'm waiting the for the comeback. When we were in school. I'm waiting for the comeback. When we were in school, yeah. there was Coney. You remember Coney? <laughs> yeah. The black one. Why, you know the black guy? Why are kids in Bankstown scared Coney's going to come get them <laughs> oh, bro. from Africa? That is the biggest fucking throwback ever. Coney, remember that? We saw it in English. And, um, in English? Yeah, we were proper like... Yeah, fuck, is this guy gonna come and <laughs> fucking build an army or what? Oh, Coney's like, and like the videos are like all like seven year olds, like, like AK 47s. Yes, <laughs> am I about to get scouted, <laughs> bro? Bro, 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 that was like, bro, that was a good time. Then there was, there's like ISIS, peak ISIS, bro. Everything you tell them, to ISIS, 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 bro. Even we had a kid that got accused. I don't know how true it was, but then you're thinking, I heard fuck? about that. Who's They're like a white guy that went to like apparently he went to. Like I, I don't know, but then you start thinking, what the fuck, what's going on here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If people are affiliated, but of course, fucking there's a, there's a couple of people in my school that I'm just like, oh, exactly. It starts having you thinking. So it gets you thinking, yeah. but it's fucking bullshit. Yeah, yeah. bullshit. The they, they cops came. I swear to God, they came to our school hall and they're like. They wanted to like investigate it and this and that. I'm like, fuck off! Like, what are you doing? Like, we're just, they're just praying. Like, everyone's just praying. Let's relax a bit. But yeah, it just got weird. It got weird, eh? And like the principal at the time was just weird as well. He didn't want us. We not. We didn't. We weren't allowed to have those um, hats and graduation. He, got, he was just a fucking spinner. Like it was just the biggest spinner school. <laughs> He's like, he, at the time he was like a revert, right? I turned Muslim, and then he went on this like journey, and he's just like, nah, boys, like. We're not going to have those hats because they bring American culture into our school. Oof, bro. Who's this guy? Who the fuck are you? Like, we're fucking just graduated, cunt. Like, give us the fucking hats. <laughs> who's this Sada bloke? 80, who, who is this bloke? <laughs> and we didn't have the hats. And it was just, we didn't get our U12 jerseys till the last two weeks of U12. Uh, it was proper, proper weird, bro. It was weird. I love school. That was the best. But yeah. what was the life change after? How easy was it? Oh, bro. Like, eh, Where you get your know. style from? I'm just drippy, bro. What do you like? What do you? I'm, what do you drew in spo from? Because kind of changed up, didn't it? Yeah, it, it changed up. I used to be, um, you know, what? I've never dressed like a spinner. You like, never really dressed like loud or to dress. Nah, there. never, never, never. You just wore I, whatever. Yeah, just wore whatever at, the, at a time, like in the industry yeah, and yeah, shit yeah. like that. Used to always be the industries and this and that, but then. But now you're like shopping to dress. Now I'm just like I just like to be a fresh cunt. What are you I look, just try are you to looking be. at? I, I shit. like. I just like to. I'm on the I, I like the little brands. The small the small brands on Instagram, you know how you find them? It's like a brand that I love at the moment. It's called Alfred's Apartment or something. Bro, these brands are just like Australian brands and they just have gun clothes, bro. But I'm a very I'm a very vintage shopper now. I hate buying clothes, bro. Bro. I'm big tight ass. I only yeah? buy specials. Yeah. Basics from like um the Uniqlo. Oh, I love Uniqlo. And then I'll wear these guys clothes, my bet my my mates. What is that? I always see you wearing it. What Active is it? Wear. You've, bro, like, what was it? How do you even say it? Fooks? Fooks. So then their last name's Fuka Fuka. Fuka Fuka. They used to be called like Sioni Fooks. Fooks was a thing. And oh. FKZ short. So the two brothers and they made Two brothers business? used to play footy for like the Bulldogs, 20s and that. Like gun clothes? I like yeah, the shirt. Gun, gun. It's good. I'll show you some after I got the hat and stuff. You yeah. have to try it out if you're going to. You're training too. I train, you're yeah. Training, you're training. I'm and you're getting, getting better and better and better. They just started. I want a, I want a good, I want a good like. Um, Active gear. Bro, place. watch this. I'll show you the quarter zip I got. Gun? Well, yeah, brother. 
gun. Sexy. I've just been on the Nike wave, eh? I've just been on the Nike Rebel wave. This has got that Nike feel to it, but has it? And you wear it in the gym, and it's like a different brand. It's got that look. Your people will be looking. What's that? I want something like it's that. Sexy. I and want it's something. It's dropping like that. soon, and there's an orange. Uh, sorry, a, a blue one. I haven't worn it yet in yeah. any photos because I was uh. waiting. I was meant to have a good guest on. I was gonna wear it, you know. <laughs> good guest. Oh. Like a like a. <laughs> let's say a viral, a viral guest. Okay, I okay. knew this is gonna get seen. <laughs> I gotta save this blue one. <laughs> of course. I haven't worn it to the gym. Nothing because yeah. I don't want to get dirty. <laughs> Voila. Like, is it light blue, dark blue? What is it? Light blue. Gun? Like I'm dying loud. To, I'll loud. show you after. It sounds loud. It's loud, but it's sexy. I'm dying to wear it, Walla. Yeah. But like, no, they're, they're good, bro. They get better and better. And I like their style. Yeah, yeah. It's it looks good. I'm, um, yeah. I, in terms of, I don't really look much into like active wear. Yeah. I just, I, I really focus. But we when used I go to wear out, footy gear and stuff. Yeah. That's what I used to. Exactly. I always used to wear like fucking. Because I played North Sydney Bears. Every time I went Ski. to the gym, I wear my North Sydney Bears shorts. Yeah. Same. Or Lebanon shorts. Yeah. Or this and that, you know. But in terms of going out, I, I'm, I, I rock hard with Ye, getting like Yeezys yeah, and stuff. Yeah, I love, I love Ye. So the, all the controversy that's going around I around still him, love him. I still love him. Love I still love him. him. I don't give a fuck. Kanye is Kanye. He is. He does, says what he says and we don't ever, you know. I haven't heard from him in a while, but I'm a bit worried. Yeah, I know. The, the Matrix is going to get him. Um, um, do you like Crocs? You know what? I want to get into them. That's best. One of my mates, I went out with my mate one of the uh, the other day. We're going to get, we, we get we only got tattoos, and he's wearing them. And I'm like, "Fuck, you're a fresh cunt. Like they look good, but you have to be able to rock them, eh? Yeah, you got to rock them well. Long socks, long have socks. some drip on them too. Yeah, some yeah. accessories like those shoes. You know, the Birkenstocks. Yep. Like them. Yeah. If you're fucking wearing them just like that, you're gonna look like a shit cunt. Yeah. Like, bro, wear them properly. If you're not gonna wear them properly, don't wear them. But bro, tell me why my Crocs fucking shrunk in the car no. on a hot day. How does that even they, happen? How do Crocs, like they were in the car, it was a hot day and they shrunk. If anything, they're meant to expand. Exactly, aren't they meant to expand? Because they don't fit me anymore. No, they don't. Like literally, they went two sizes down. Is it the one that you, is it they're those, black. Is it those Crocs that you put them in sports mode when you put the thing down as Yeah, well? like proper Crocs, proper original Crocs. black ones, and they fucking shrunk two sizes down. They don't fit me anymore. I've got to get new ones. You, so you, don't leave them in the car. Don't leave them in the car? No. Nah. I need to get a pair, to be honest, but whenever I'm wearing my socks, I just wear like fucking Adidas slides. Ah, Crocs are way better. Are they? Oh, bro, once I got them, never turn back. I'll, I'll wear them like every day. If Comfortable? I Com- bro, it, I wear them to it, work. Is it one of those shoes that you wear before you hop onto like, you know, I'm holding my Jordans in my hand, like my hand looking, bro, sussing bro, out the core. I'm telling you, if you go into the, the park core. and you're wearing Crocs with drip, yeah. you're going to look like it's a proper. sick It's proper. Uh, I would have you. You would have you? I would have you. <laughs> <laughs> I would have you. Bro. Headphones on with Crocs. When this, Crocs. When, this, when this game happens... That we're gonna, we're gonna play against each other. You gotta live stream it. You gotta do something. I'm gonna make gonna an edit it. out of this saying, like, I'm gone, I'm gone, and then, like, me on your head. Say less. Say less. <laughs> I'm gonna head. do that. I'm gonna be smoking on that notorious podcast pack. Oh, please. I'm gonna be smoking on that Nabil please. pack. Please. I'm gonna be smoking on that pack, bro. Like, trust me. Watch, it'll be a good game. All right. We, game. We're gonna play one on one as well. All right. You know, we yeah. play three on threes. We'll, we'll play one on one. Yeah, yeah, 100%. One. I'm more, of a, I'm more of a team player, but we'll play one oh. on one. <laughs> I'm an honest guy. Listen, I'm one right. of, uh, if you had to compare yourself to one player, who would it be? Honest comparison. Honest comparison. In Australian No, no NBA players? player. NBA player? Yeah, like style of play. Style of play. In terms of like how much shit I talk, bro, like I don't stop. I don't stop. So I'm just that confident when I play. I, skill too. Like skill, skill too. Skill, skill comparison. Too. I can't dunk, obviously, fuck. But yeah, but like style. Style, I'd say. Like for me, I would go... Um, I'll probably play like honest comparison. Pat Bev Draymond Green style. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> what are we in mix? <laughs> like that. Yeah, Fun. I was a bit of a grubbing footy yeah. too, you know. You yeah, remember? Pat Bev. So like Fun. as Russ said, he just you know, you yeah. just make you know, you nah, just run nah, up and nah, down nah. the court. Come you on. fool everybody. More Draymond Green, like you, the you passing, the vision, like you know. Not even gonna lie, not even gassing myself up. I'll shoot like clay. Oh my god. Bro, what do you what do you ask me then? Oh my god. I'm giving you All the right, answer. Keep going, keep going, keep I'm going. giving you the answer. I shoot like Clay, lights out, lights out. Everyone knows me, I sit in the court. Oh, I shoot, I shoot, I shoot, I shoot. Oh, shoot. He came, he came, he came. Everyone shits there. I go, hey, boys, chill, chill. <laughs> chill, chill. chill. Oh, I shoot like Clay. But in terms of like, you know, talking shit, driving and things like that, I'll, I'm more like Russ. I think he's going to say that. More like, and I'm fast ass on the court. Mm. I'm fast ass on the court. What's the deal? Do you play full court or half court? I like I half play court. Whatever. I play like, I prefer like a half course gun. Like half course mad. Bro. Full course so tiring, <laughs> but I feel like half course just mad. Eh? Like clearing it, it's just good like that. Yeah. Everyone's so used to it now, especially all the courses that you go to. Straight away, all yeah, right. Up to eleven, twos and ones, clear everything. Bang, start, it is. check. It is. It's, it's fast like that. And like yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I wanna, I wanna, I wanna see. And you know what I don't like about full court, especially if you play pickup, is like the easy layups and shit. It's it shit, ruins bro. the game. 
It, people get tired so easily at full court. Unless you're playing with gun players, like all those Australian gun players. Yeah. Don't fucking, like, if I'm going to Sydney and I'm versing a couple of, like, gun Asians, like, they're not, why am I going to play full court? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, we'll keep our fast break points Yeah, and shit. just play half court, bro. It's, it takes more skill anyway if you're playing half court, right? Because yeah. you you're always in their face. What do you want to see? What were you going to say? I was going to say, I was going to see, I, was, I want to see how we go. Like, say, for example, me and you, right? Call me, call me one day. Oh, let's go. Let's go Sydney. Park take over. Let's go. <laughs> Would you go? Yeah. We'll go play. Fuck no. Test, uh, test I don't out care the waters. If they're good. <laughs> I don't care. You know me. I don't care about like. You I know, hate losing. You know, if someone does that to me and dunks <laughs> me. I'll fucking pack it up. I hate losing. I love winning, but I don't mind if I lose because I I don't know. I like. I get a thrill out of. Oh fuck this guy! I'm gonna get him next time. I'm the biggest. Like, it's, I'm the biggest sore loser. It's a little br- little brother thing. My brother used to be in everything, bro. Yeah, I'm the biggest sore loser. I can't. Yeah, I hate losing. Mm. And I'll talk shit, mm. but at the same time, I kind of like it because it makes me want to play again. Right, yeah. Let's go again. My mate, my mate, one of my closest mates is a center. And whenever we go, we always go How pull up. How tall is he? He's not that tall. He's like, uh, I'd say maybe 6'4". I don't know. But he plays like a center? He's like 6'6", six, six, something like that. So I don't know. He plays like a center? He plays like a center, but he's, he's actually pretty gun, right? Yeah. And whenever we go to Sydney, it's like Kobe and Shaq time. All uh, right, let's go. All right, set the screen. Go so is there the like full two on two games? Bro, you, have you ever been there? No, I haven't. Sydney is like proper, like Venice Beach. How many, how many courts? Two full courts, but there's like four games going on. It's like proper like Venice Beach. I haven't even been to Venice Beach, but <laughs> I always see it. It's proper like that, like music's pumping. Ah. Yeah, no, no, bro, it's proper. Like, lights mu- on. Lights on, music's pumping. Lights turn off maybe like 10 p.m. Um, music's pumping, people are playing. All right, you're off next. Blah, blah, blah. And, bro. No like dramas? If, no dramas, nah. Everyone's just gun. Like, you know, you're good, you're good, you shit, you shit. Like, you lose, hop off. Winner stays on. And, like, bro, there's so many times, like, we go there. And like they look at us like fucking shit, Lebos, blah 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 blah, and we fucking pump everyone. Really, bro? I swear, that's so only. It mustn't be that gun, bro. I'm telling you, we're gun. I want to I want to go next time. No, I understand. We're good, bro. We're next good. Next time you go, let me know. We're good. I'll fucking take on anyone in basketball. I don't care. Don't right, care who you we'll are. Organize it. Don't care who you are. I know who I'm gonna get. I know who I'm gonna get. I've went to Nawi so many times. When I told you all those gun players that go there, we'll play at Nawi. We'll wrap it up. But I think that's fucking a quick. How on 30 minutes, huh? How on 30 minutes? Bro? How was your podcast debut? Bro, I'm fresh. I'm looking good. Talking about my basketball. You feel like lo- you can talk about anything? I feel like I can talk about anything, bro. I feel like I'm rapping to the mic. I swear the first time I put this on, I put on a song. You know what? Fuck it. We'll do it. Let's go. What is that? I'll show you what it's like to have a song on here. I've oh, made a song no. before as well. I love music too. Let me connect it real quick. I probably love, I probably love making music too. Do you? Yeah, I like making music. It's good. Everyone would have left by now, but this is just for us. <laughs> <laughs> right, this have you made us? Have you? Do you make music? No, huh? no, no, that's all bullshit. That's just me. I was shooting content for a rapper, like a, an artist. Yeah, that's I saw me that. in the studio. Just like where was that? And this, uh, I was a studio in Alexandria. Yeah, um, is he a good rapper? Bro, I'll play you his song. Oh, let's go. We'll listen to the whole three minutes because it gets know. like the drop gets good at the end. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. This is a if I don't like it, I don't like it. If I like it, I like it. In my mind, you're impatient, but in my life, you're contagious. This is an Easter egg. I know the love getting crazy. If you're still around, I know the time became wasted. Supporting the podcast. I can love <laughs> to racing. 99, I was facing. I know it's time to replace this. It's different. Changed, I like it. I was it's so fast, good. Fighting No, 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 no Fighting Oh, no, 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 no I'm probably gonna cut it right now Baby, in the morning oh, This is for me and you I responded I know I've been missing Left too homeless Can't promise I'm ever gonna change I like it I understand 